I'm Pat Kennedy, founder of OSI Soft. SoftBank is our largest outside investor, and I appreciate the opportunity to speak to this audience. We've been doing streaming data management for nearly 40 years, and we keep expanding to more and more industries and collecting more and more information, all the time working to increase scale, use of modern technology, and support all existing customers. We help users see failures before they happen and defects before they are shipped. What initially impressed me about SoftBank was the fact that they'd actually published a 300-year plan. OSI Soft has similar aspirations in that we manage for longevity. Profits and growth are not necessarily a goal. They're really the result, and I believe the 300 years looks achievable. I'm delighted to be part of such a philosophy, but it also must be good for SoftBank. And I'm sure the question arises as to what advantage OSI Soft can bring. I'd like to address that. The industrial internet of things is the next large user of telecom services. If you go back a few years, we saw within the telecom business that voice could be 90% of the profits, but data was 90% of the growth. The obvious happened, data took over, and voice now has actually been removed from some of the telecom circuits. I think you'll see the same thing happening with IIoT or IoT or M2M, whatever you want to call it. The communication between machines will soon eclipse the data transfer that we have today, just as the data transfer eclipsed the voice of yesterday. This is what we do, and I'm delighted to be part of this.